very good. Now, holy moly. Back to game, Wobbly. Back to game. Let's go. Jasky, your hydration, sir. Here we go. Hope you're doing well. Coming out of, uh, you'll be starting to come out of winter over there now. Mm -hmm. Oh, I do a couple of sips. It is rather hot. Mm -hmm. Oh, there we go. Holy moly. Thank you for that hydration, Jasky. The hydration has been honoured. Okay, 4 minutes 40 for you. We've got 47 seconds for you. Let's hope that uh, we can get um, cuddles on all of them. Now, the problem that I might have, I might actually get... I want to test this. I might grab those extra cryopods out. I wonder if it does a similar thing to... Um, Oh shit, where do I put those other cryopods? Hello? Um, oh, they're up. They're on my inventory. Holy moly. Wobbly, wobbly, wobbly. It's alright. Pro gamer right here. Whee! How's that move with the tail? Who was that cheeky bastard? That was the old... Um, Cuddle? Oh. Excellent. We like the cuddles. Now, 146, 133, you're going to be next. So we might have a look at uh, turning off their... Um, I said, I'm hoping they're not too close. Might get you to um, follow... Oh, actually, you might... No, 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 stop there. Ooh, gee, that was close. Holy... Okay, stop there. Okay. Follow distance back to normal on these. How long have we got? Minute 10 on you, 59 seconds on you. Behaviour, follow distance out to back out to medium. Mm -hmm. I'm going to put, um, I'll leave that actually because we're going to be out in the desert with these guys soon, or girls. So we'll get, um, what I might do, we're going to get these breeding, but I'm actually going to be using them as well in the boss battle. Um, I'll keep one. So if we fail at, at the boss fight, we can at least get an army, replacement army together. Stambo's here. What's up, Wobbly? Hello, Stambo. Welcome, welcome. How's Stambo going? I'm we'll have to get a shout out for Stambo. Here we go. Ned's here. It's ASMR. Singing time with Wobbly. Get one of my mods onto a shout this out one's for Stambo. For you, Cliffy. Whoop, Let's lick eight seconds the here. From Prime meat jerky. Kill soul ball the mouse. Make the shit logs. And go, go and put, put them, them in, in the wall. wall. Basic kibble. Whoop, 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 whoop. Okay, let's, let's go. Soul ball More you singing. as well. Come on, Wobbly. You can do it. Yes, yes you, can. you can. Singing on a Friday. Whoop, 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 No, that... Holy moly. So, um... If you're not following Stambo, smash that link for me and go and send Stambo a follow. He's a, um, I've known Stambo for many, many, many years, part of the camper crew, and um, he's only fairly new to streaming, so hasn't got a huge following. So smash that link, go and send Sam Stambo a, a follow, and that way when Stambo goes live, quite often Stambo d does um, some... Um, PUBG with uh, Groby so um, that way you'll be able to see from Stambo's point of view when they're doing a bit of um, PUBG so smash smash that link give him a follow if you're not following him already okay we don't need that on anymore now time has gone down on this let's see if this made a difference with cryopods it does. Fuck yeah. Excellent. Okay, so we can get our imprinting on these as well by utilising our um, 
our cryopods. So um, if you don't get the imprint that you want, cryopod it and re-throw it out as well. Holy moly. Oh, oh Ned, pineapple. holy shit balls. Pineapple. pineapple. Ned's coming in with a gifted sub to Stambo as well. Holy moly, thank you for that gifted sub, Ned. Do appreciate that. Here's, that's worth singing about. This one's for Stambo and go. for Ned. It's cheers for the shout out. Time with Stambo's wobbly. got a gifted sub. This one's for Stambo you, can wobbly wobbly way. Let's now lick the frog. Lick it hard. Kill Oop, the another mess. cuddles. Make the shit logs. This is going to be and close. Go and put them in the wall. Twenty-eight whoop, seconds whoop, wobbling. Whoop, whoop. Let's go. More singing. Come on, wobbly. You can do it. Yes, you can. Singing on a Friday. Whoop, 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 whoop. No, that. Okay, let's have a look see what we've got in print wise on this I want to try and get uh, or try and get if we can get one to a hundred percent that's going to be the wrecks that we end up riding in battle cook prime meat sorry that's not what we need so we're going to solve all this one up holy moly okay we're going to put that one there I only got three cryopods Tell you what, it was worth grabbing, getting some of them in the um, Christmas one. I should have gone out, and done more drops. So uh, it would have been good. Cheers for the shout out, and thanks, Ned from Stambo. Cheers, mate. No worries. Holy moly. So uh, now let's get a look here. Mutations. So we've got. Um, Gonna be close on this one to put the imprint here. We've got eight seconds. Let's have a look. We'll go with uh, we'll go with this one. Put that one there. The time is gone, so we've got our crow. Now, what do you want? Go on a walk. Holy shit. Um, I don't know if I want to walk. I'm gonna read read pop you. Um, I might not. Might not actually end up getting 100% imprint on that. Might have been faster to do the walk. Hey, what do we got there? 1 minute 54. I've got to make sure that we get a... Uh, I don't want to accidentally throw one out. It'll end up asleep. I'll just make sure we manage that. This is our next one that's wanting an imprint. What do we got? We're up to 33. Hopefully we can get that one. This one... We want to get our next imprint. Hopefully this will give us a 100% imprint on this one. We've got two minutes and we'll find out on that. Uh, let's have a look. So the good thing on single player, I have got these wound up slightly with regards to maturing and hatching because we're not going to spend all our time uh, waiting around for that. It's just going to take too long. Uh, when you're on a server you can leave the dinos out and they'll grow up and you come back the next day and they've almost grown up but when you're on single player when you leave everything freezes you come back in and um, you have to be in game for your progression with single player so we've got uh, that's why I ramped up some of the maturation on these 140 on that let's hope we get a cuddle uh, I'll put um, that on there. It's going to eat all of this. Look at this food. Holy moly. It's going to go through all of that. Okay, mm -hmm. 23 seconds. Uh, this is the one that I really want to try and get 100% imprint on if we can. 87. We've got uh, a little bit of time. One minute. Let's hope this is a cuddle. Let's hope it's a cuddle. Quick sip on our cup of tea. Mm-hmm. 30 seconds on our cryopod cuddle. Fuck you, game. Um, actually, we can... Uh, we've got 17 seconds on that. We can probably cryopod this guy. We can... Uh, well, it's a girl, wobbly. It's a girl. 
and we've got 40 seconds left on that. Timer's up on our cryopod. Rethrow that back out. Prime meat jerky. No! Okay, we're going to have to wait. Uh, looks like we're going to miss out on that one. I should have done the mail, actually. Um, maybe I'd do that. Actually, you know what? Actually, that's a breeder, so it's not really mattering anyway. Uh, this one. More important to try and get one that gets 100% rider imprinting on it come on cuddle regular kibble no come on i ain't got long and you'll be growing up let's hope uh, we get something decent so the problem that i've now got i'm gonna have to wait all and all in um let's free up a this one no they all oh this one was the male as well that's all right if we get the imprint on this one, then um, we'll be able to ride it. That's fine. Um, we're not going to get 100% imprinting on this. Because uh, we haven't got the prime meat jerky. We're just waiting for that cryopod timer. I don't have a free cryopod. I could throw one of these others out to... Um, it's really the male, but I want the male because that's the one I want the 100% on. It's at 67, 66%. That one's got no imprint on, in, on it at all yet. That one's at 33%. You can actually see that on the on the actual uh, tripod there. Right, I'm getting a little bit... Uh, let's gamma. So I should have done three of these at a time, which we had done. We got the three eggs. It's just that we got the twins. Got the twins at the end. Holy moly. Now, this one's... I'll just have as a breeder. Uh, the ones that have got really shit mute... Um, on the imprinting, we're going to use for breeding anyway, so it's not too bad if it's the female ones. Okay, our time is now done, so we're going to go. We've got the male in number four slot. Come on, go on a walk. Shit, you're going to actually have to. Um... Okay, come on, follow, go low. Uh, we might need to uh, quickly come on. Follow. Okay, we got the imprint. Nice. Just before it matures into an adult. Excellent. Just before it matures into an adult. So this one's a male. I'll actually use this one for um, for I'll put him up here. These guys for the moment. Are you fully matured? Yep. Right. Mhm. Mm so this one is going to get changed. Ride me. It's got a hundred percent. Um, imprinting benefit on it 100% imprinting so we're going to get that rider benefit when we're on that I didn't have a look whether he got the melee or uh, the other before we go and put any um, any stats into it alright let's get uh, we've still got a minute four uh, you've almost We'll have one chance at um, getting an imprint on this girl before she um, finishes. Right, uh, might even have a look at leaving them soulboard, but this is how we're going to get them get them up to the um, sandworm area. I did actually think that I was going to have to um, probably. 
do a bit of a, a land run and run them all up on via the land. Let's go and get some, get a drink, wobbly. A little bit thirsty, mate. A little bit thirsty. Stop whinging. We're on our way to the well. There you go. Some hydration alert, wobbly. Please hydrate. Hydration me. Is that alert. Jasky again. Hydration alert. No. Hydration alert, wobbly. Ned been cheeky bastard. Holy moly. Thank you for that, Ned. Holy moly. Argy's got a level. Oh, Argy's got some uh, loot for me as well. Um, what do I want to get for the Argy? Probably carry weight, I'm thinking. Maybe a bit of speed as well. So we can carry our, um, our Anki. I have only got a small one. Now, let's get uh, some of these fires burning wobbly. Um, mm -hmm. I need to get uh, some metal cooking. Okay. Now, all of that uh, wood, I'll grab some of that. Okay, we're a bit cucumber dee. Mm -hmm. Let's put tent into there. Okay, we're good. Right, we want to break that wood down. Uh, we're going to go with 625 in each of these. Just get these all set up. I won't get them cooking yet. We've got another four. We'll break this next stack down. Two and a half. I was trying to think why uh, we ended up with even stacks in there, but we took the uneven um, we took the uneven stack um, away. Someone got some nice little kills. That poor raptor came in trying to be a smart aleck and uh, got itself sorted out. Right, gonna drop that and let's get. Um, I'm going to put all the things that we're sorting out into here, plus our hide. We've got an event coming as well. Alright, we also wanted to sort all these out. I'm going to put storage-wise. Oh, we can cook that up as well. Okay, we'll put thatch into there. Those. Flint in that one. Uh, hide can come into one of these others. This can be all the unusual sorts of things into that one, which that's unusual there. This one can be that. So one of the things with the No Ingram playthrough, the biggest thing is that you can't get, um, in regards to making clay, um, like making spark powder, making um, making cementing paste, making gunpowder. Some of those things that you use in the mortar and pestle, you can get a blueprint for a mortar and pestle, but you can't craft anything in it because you don't, um, you're not learning the Ingram. So all this charcoal that we've got, I can't turn it into, I can't turn it into anything because we don't, we haven't learnt the Ingram for that. So we're doing a no Engram playthrough, so we're not spending Engram points on anything. These ones here are automatically unlocked, so there's not much I can do about that. So I would have preferred for them not to be automatically unlocked. It'd be better if you actually start at level zero, and your first level you get, you unlock those. That's one of the things I wish Wildcard actually in introduced, but um, that's not, not the case. So, um, as you can see, everything's still there. We've down here. This is the Ingrams that we've learnt based on the level that we're at, and we've spent nothing. This is what you've spent your Ingram points on. We haven't spent any Ingram points, and we're still doing our full no Ingram playthrough. We're only utilising what we find 
in drops and what we get from kills as well. So blueprints are critical. Um, the having a uh, smithy is critical. Things like a smithy on the um, no, we didn't have it on that one. What did we have the our first smithy saddle? We had um, actually it was on this, wasn't it? I just needed to do this one. Uh, no. Oh, we, it's not showing anything there because we haven't learned anything, I don't think. But we can actually utilise um, that as a smithy. Now, Rex Saddle, maybe. What are we wanting? So we need to get out and kill things for hide. We need a lot more fibre and we need more ingots cooking up as well. How are these going? We need to go and get some more ingots. I've got plenty of metal here. We'll go on get the Anki out and go harvesting some metal. Uh, we'll get that cooking. Okay, there's another 800. So we're getting close to... We've got an ingots for the, another one. Nice. Now, what else have we got in here? Hide. Yeah, we've got some more hide. That can all come out to here. Hide and fibre. Wobbly. And fiber. About that top one. Fiber. No. Okay, hide into there. Is that enough hide? It is. So just some fiber now. We need two and a bit thousand in fibers. Actually, this other... Did we have a Rex out? No, we didn't. Okay, we should be... Oh, yeah, that Wyvern tail. Oh, no. Now, let's get one of these out. Which one was this? This was a 33%. 33. And that one had nothing. Go with one of these ones. Hello. Oh, Okay, why is that not throwing that out for me? Oh, no. oh, damn it. The electric storm affects the cryopods. You can't throw out a cryopod in an electric storm. I never knew that. There you go. Cryopod, the electric storm's affecting it. So we can't uh, throw that out. Holy moly, I thought something was broken. Well, it was during an electric storm. Okay, well, we'll go and get... Um, metal's going to be an issue for us. We also wanted to sort shit out. Let's do that. Um, we've actually got two of the artifacts. We've only got one more artifact to get. And we need to get some talons as well. So we're going to have to go and set up out on the desert to, um, to try and get some of the... Um, those megatherium saddle blueprint that was another option for me if I couldn't get Rex saddle we we're gonna have a look at megatheriums or Argies we also had that blueprint for the Argies as well 336 really good blueprint but very very expensive 34,000 hide so um, but we're, we're chasing that um, that Rex saddle blueprint. We were chasing it and we got it. We don't have a UT, so we do need to have a look at getting getting a UT. Um, now some of this other gear we can get out of here as well. That's resource, that's a resource, that's a resource. Mm -hmm. Okay, this one I'm thinking I'm going to put um, some of the unusual things into there as well. Actually, probably some of the basic things into this one. Because we were putting the unusual ones in the end here, weren't I? Mm -hmm. So we'll get the basic resources out of this one. That in there. This was for 
basic resources, those, uh, the thatch. They're unusual resources, we'll get them out. Oh, we've got 2,100 fibre there, we'll grab that. Okay, that's unusual. Uh, that's also unusual. Okay, those. Holy moly wobbly, actually that metal is not unusual. Let's make sure everything is sort of unusual resources. That's not really a resource. On there. Have we got darts? Um, blueprint for some trank darts. We'll have to have a look. I'm going to put those in there for the moment. Uh, beyond the weapons, weapons, trank dart. No, we don't. So we don't have a blueprint for trank darts. We do have a blueprint for the simple rifle. So we can have a look at that. Uh, gunpowder is going to be the issue though. The gunpowder that we got, um, I suppose if we tried to destroy things. Uh, that can come out of there, that. I might actually, actually I'll put them back in there. Basic resources back to the unusual ones. Mm -hmm. There we go, we've got plenty of space now. That uh, stacking mod's definitely helping for some of this now, which is good. Right, oh, no. okay, we're good on those. Let's get that fibre into there. Was that enough for us to get that made? I'm a little bit short. 4,000. Only a little bit short wobbly. Okay. Looks like Rog got the last bite, I think, on this one. Oh well. <laughs> Actually, didn't get me that one, whoever that was. Yes, we're looking into the nose of uh, Rodgina here, but um, that didn't get me. Who was that cheeky bugger? Holy moly. Cheers, mate. Ned, T. Rodation, in game. Oh, drink an in game, wobbly. Hurry up. And uh, Clippy with the T Rex Raw. There's another T Hydration for, uh, for you. Actually might not have um, got that. Right, I'm going to go with... Let's have a look. This one actually didn't get the... Um, missed the health. I think it got the melee though. I think it got the melee. Let's put here, missed... Missed health stat. And this means we're probably going to have to put some extra boosts here into that. Nice boost into the melee. Right, uh, 32k, got a thousand on that. We'll get these up around that 50k. I'm thinking of possibly taking some of these out, leveling them up. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, take him. Okay, we're up to getting some fibre wobbly. Now we'll be able to throw that um, cryopod out. Holy moly. Thanks for those bits, Clippy. Dry, scare, wobbly, T Rex, raw, cheeky bastard. Use that sickle, baby. Might harvest this entire area. We're going to need the um, fibers. So, grunting away. So, I was looking at, um, I believe, Ark is looking at running into a higher engine, Unreal Engine 5, for the existing game. And, um, there's a lot of talk in regards to the channels, in regards to 
if I actually do that, um, it's actually going to affect a lot of the mods because by the time a lot of the mods that people use they'll be incompatible with uh, the Unreal Engine 5 platform so they need the the um, dev kit upgraded and things the mods to be all worked on there's a lot of mods that are no longer in development and the authors have um, pretty much stopped working with them which means that it's going to create create problems so um, it's going to be interesting times ahead I think so we need to get a lot more ingots we'll need to get some hide I think we're cranking all right on the fiber aren't we it's not too bad Rightio, oh, yeah, there's another wreck saddle baby holy moly that's nice now we need to go get some more ingots and get them cooking I also need to sort out these as well let's get um, some of these resources sorted out of here. Mm -hmm. Some mining paste. Bizzles is here. Oh, welcome, Bizzles. Oh, welcome, welcome. Holy moly! I was quite impressed with a lot of your playthrough with Val. I'm holy moly. Oh, who's that cheeky fucker trying to get me with a gunshot? Bizzles coming in with a gunshot. Cheeky bastard. Holy moly. Didn't get me too bad then. Uh, sorry about that. <laughs> he tried. He tried. Some might say Bizzles is very trying. But, uh, did enjoy uh, watching you uh, dying and getting back to your body there in the in the cold snow when you were out hunting in the caves exploring those so um, did enjoy that lurking away yesterday he was lurking we're gonna get that um, ingots up and right yeah let's have a look at getting this uh, now that the storm's over we should be able to use these cryopod let's get these going that one had 33% imprinting on it let's go wobbly oh uh, not too worried that's that wyvern tail again cheeky fucker so, yep so that's exactly what it was basic kibble we ain't got basic kibble um i wonder if i can get one more go before that matures it's almost about to fully mature holy moly we're gonna have to wait a little bit let's go and get a um saddle on our rex our ride me rex Ride me, baby. Ride me. Mm hmm. Poor Bizzles trying to get me with the gunshot. Oh, moly. So, um, yes. And your wower mode going alright on there. What we might do, we might actually take this Rex out for a run and um, chomp on a few things. We need some hide, lots of hide. And we need to get some levels on it as well, so. Might as well do a bit of munchy munch. Come on, back here, baby. Don't take me over to the Microraptors. Okay, I've got two levels. Let's go for a bit of health. Some of that. Oh shit, what are you eating the raw meat for, Wobbly? Holy moly, damn it. Okay, we don't want to be eating the raw meats. Okay. Now we do need some names on some of these. We've got um, Bizzles Rex is in here. He'll be going out to the old um, out just there. There's Bizzles as Rex. We're on the single player playthrough. We'll jump down here and we'll jump off our Rex so we don't get the full damage. Well, we we might get full damage, but that way the Rex doesn't get it. another level we'll go for a bit of melee this time we're after the hide harvest and hide actually you're not going to be the best hide harvester you know what I'm thinking I'm thinking we go out on the wyvern and it's actually a pretty good it is a reasonable hide gatherer but I'm thinking we're going to go out on the um, wyvern 
Right -o. Now, where's my date on this guy? Okay, you got heaps of food. I'll grab something back off you. It's that one up the top there. It's still really short of food. I'll get that going. Get out on the wyvern for a bit of a fly wobbly. And, um, okay, our cryopod timer has gone again. This will be our last chance, probably on this one. Cuddle, come on. Cooked meat. Oh shit, have we got some? Uh, la -da 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 -da. Cooked meat, baby, come on. We should have some somewhere. Cooked meat, cooked meat, cooked meat, cooked meat, cooked meat. I've got some here. Come on, quickly get to it. Get to it before it matures. Come on. Okay, we got one. Okay, we're not going to get the next imprint on that. That's as good as that one's going to get. So that's fine. Um, okay, so this will be one of our breeders. Did you get the health and the melee? I think you did as well. Oh, son of a bitch, that's right. When we cryopod it, we end up losing those, um, those folders. Okay, so that's why we're better off doing it in the name. Okay, now what was it again? Let's have a look. Holy shit. Good on you, Wobbly. This is laughing away. So it'd be in the evening now for Bizzles, wouldn't it? No. Uh, that's a low one. Who's dinging and donging? Septic Falcon coming in with the raid. Holy moly. I have to get all over Septic with the. Uh, where's my breeders? Oh, we had our big boy. This is. Where is he? No, what have I done? What have you done, Wobbly? Um, possibly this one. Welcome, Septic. Welcome. Hey, hey, Wobbly. Hey there, Septic. Hope you're doing well. Holy moly. Gonna play Sons of the Forests? Uh, I will. I will be uh, when it comes out. So it is on my wish list. We'll wait and see. We'll wait and see. Ned's all over Septic with a shout out. Hope you're doing well, dude. Doing very well. I thought Jasky might have been straight on to uh, giving the old shout out for Septic. Jasky might have gone to sleep. It might be sleep time. Oh, here's our, um, this is our male breeder here. So, 8, 140 and 482. 8, 140 and 482. I'm pretty sure that's what we got on these. 8140 and 482. 8140, 482. 81. Real bearded. Nearly. Holy moly, I like that name. Okay, let's uh, let's go here. Change. So, 8140. And melee damage was 482. Okay. Right, uh, so at least that way when we've got that in there, um, it doesn't matter about the folders, but we're probably not going to be cry-potting these much, too much more. So that's one of our female breeders, and uh, we, at least we can check for mutations in the each of those. But we haven't got the time to do lots and lots of breeding and lots of mutations. We want to get that final, get our talons, wyvern talons. We want to get uh, some of these rexes leveled and we want to um, get our rex saddles made and we want to go out and um, get ready for defeating the old um, manticore boss on this no Ingram playthrough. So um, it's behind you. Jasky is rubbish. <laughs> Lol, thanks dude. <laughs> Holy moly. And uh, yes, Jasky must be asleep at the minute. So uh, must be asleep. But I'm um, pretty tired. We're in the middle of uh, turtle season, well near in the end of turtle season for me. So uh, which is good. I'll get a bit more time up my sleeve in probably another six weeks. Which means more gaming, more streaming. What we're doing here, this is a series that I've been uploading to YouTube. It's a no Ingram playthrough. So with Ark, as you gain a level, you actually unlock certain things that you can craft up. So what I'm doing with this no Ingram playthrough, we haven't spent a single Ingram point. We haven't unlocked anything. 
we've turned it into an absolute survival playthrough. Everything that we find in the wild or we get from supply drops or anything we get from kills we keep and we use. So we need the blueprints. Blueprints are critical for crafting things. If we can't unlock things to craft, we need the blueprint for it. So that's where we're searching drops until we get blueprints. Blueprints for storage, for the beds, for so we can respawn. Um, yeah, critical, critical, critical. Uh, we've got a couple of beds set up. Rightio, um, what else, what else, Wobbly? I don't know whether we want to get kibbles going or not. Um, the clicks and the clacks, clicks and the clacks. So we've got our cryopod timer has run out again. Let's try again on one of these other Rexes and we can get our cryopods back. Let's hope this one is a cuddle or something good. Oh, it is a cuddle. Ask and she ye shall receive, wobbly. So we might be able to get um, full imprint on that. This one we can't. Mm -hmm. Okay, what I'm actually going to do on this one, I'm actually, I don't care if this one goes to sleep. So we're actually going to uh, soul ball this one out of here and put it around the corner. Holy moly, I'm getting hungry in real life. How'd your stream go? What were you playing? State of Decay 2. Oh, Falcon, if you're still there, I was watching. You were playing um, Generation Zero. So um, if you have that soul timer, you can see there on my, down here in the bottom bottom right, uh, that's a soul timer with the cryopods. And if you throw out your dinos too quickly, they have this uh, problem where they go to sleep on you. Sleeping on the job, wobbly. So I watched a little bit, I was, um, we did a few things today. Ah, nice, nice, nice. And great unknown, hello there, welcome, welcome, hope you're well. Um, I was watching you uh, play Generation Zero. That's one of the games that I do own, and I have played a little bit of that, but not a lot of it. Um, that's one that Tazzy and I were sort of, at one stage, thinking about hooking up and doing a bit of a playthrough on, but we never really got into it. Um, there was something about it that I wasn't overly keen on. I think it was the set loot format. I do like... Um, coming from an old oh, armor, to, armor 2 and armor 3 format where I like my loot to be a little bit randomized um, unfortunately the gen 0 it sort of had set loot in certain spots and things like that so I wasn't um, I wasn't a big fan of that I think that was the reason I sort of didn't really get too much into the gen 0 but I was watching some of some of your play there, and uh, I was actually liking what I saw regarding the depth of content. It was pretty good. Now we do want to get ourselves a decent Anki as well and get it knocked out and uh, tamed up. What do we got here? That one's a 30. We might kill that one. We want the hide as well. Good thing with the RG. The RG's pretty good at getting some hide. 77 on the hide. We'll get a bit of speed. Yeah, Generation Zero. Um, might have a look at incorporating that again. We'll see. We'll see. All right, chat. Let's have a quick vote. We'll. Um, we're just waiting on a few things. We're waiting on this cryo timer to go. On our final Rex. Hopefully, we can get an imprint on this one got seven seconds so um yeah, it's not like the normal survival games we usually play but um with with friends it's definitely better yeah that's what i was thinking because i was watching you um i think you might have been playing with your uh i think it might be your wife or your partner and um with your family and having a lot of fun it definitely looked fun i was watching when you all spawned the the bicycle and the motorbikes and they were humping each other the bikes were humping each other on the spawn point it was rather interesting yay there we go baby cuddle on that one we've got a minute 
for this one's next um, imprinting. Let's get these sorted out. Now hopefully, this is at 67%. If we can get an imprint on this, it'll go 100%. The reason we want 100% imprint on these is we get a bonus. We get a bonus in levels here, plus we also get a rider bonus when we're actually riding, which makes it uh, pretty fun. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, my wife had a go the other day. Uh, yeah, that's it. <laughs> that's how bikes are made. I always wondered how bikes were made. Uh, wow, that was so funny. I yeah, laughing on that one. I had, uh, it was interesting, the day that I was watching you do that, it was only yesterday, the day before, and... I virtually got out, it came off to make a cup, of, uh, a cup of tea and I walked out and my boss, my wife, turned to me and said, you need to um, you need to do another uh, playthrough of shit, Hazelberry Wobbly. Uh, we've got 93%. Where's our berry guys? We need Hazelberries. Okay, back here, imprint. Hell yeah, we got 100%. Nice, okay, that's good. And the wife says to me, she said, I really enjoyed when we did that, uh, the boss plays Phasmophobia, that community event, and I got the I got the wife to play Phasmophobia and uh, run around because she doesn't mind scary stuff. So, and, um, but she didn't know what the fuck was going on because <laughs> she's not a gamer either. So she was running around, it's like, what's happening? So trying to learn to game and being Im and being fully immersed into the game and getting scared are two different things so it didn't really work as well but it was funny and i know a lot of the chat and the community enjoyed having the boss on but she said the other day we need to do another one of those days where you get me on and playing your game and uh i think uh yeah i'll have to do that but i'll need to train her up a bit so she can actually get shit scared so that'll be good and real bearded Nelly in there at Septic. Would love to play Phasmo with you. <laughs> yeah, Phasmo is a good one. It's it's one of those. There's quite a few games these days where they're really just getting into that. Rather than a, a full on multiplayer on a server, they get people to host them locally and and have other people up to sort of four people join multiplayer. There's lots of games like that, like Green Hell's like that. Stranded Deep's gone down that path. You've got Phasmophobia. You've got, um, like, um, yeah, there's heaps. Heaps are running that way. Mrs. Wobbly and Ark. Yeah, well, that's the other thing that we thought of as well, Ned. Getting her onto a beach naked. Not her naked, but, you know, you spawn in naked when you start Ark. Naked on a beach and afraid. You know, we'll get her there and get the raptors eating her. Uh, that would be quite funny, wouldn't it? That would be funny. Holy moly. Septic's there. Uh, yeah, my wife's the same. No, Phasmo might be interesting with her. She's not as scared as me, though. <laughs> Holy moly. You know I love... You know I avoid Phasmo like the plague if I can help it. Well, I'm like that septic. I'm not, I'm not a big fan on um, phasmophobia. I know Tazzy, Tazzy hates phasmophobia as well. He does own it. But you know what we should do? We should do a, um, a combination with some of your, your, um, your groups with your community septic. You should put a day together for phasmophobia and get some of your other streamers to go and join up with you so that they can be streaming to their communities to make it to build the overall experience in a phasmophobia. So invite those those streamers that you've got in your in your um, team in rookie mistake <clears throat> and get them in to do one weekend try and tee up a um, phasmo. It is hard to try and get everyone together at the same time and manage it, but. Um, you probably, I think you've got a lot of UK and European streamers. You'd be able to do that. Uh, Tazzy and myself, we're on different, we're on a different planet, <laughs> being down under. Okay, we got an imprint on that. Hell yeah! So hopefully we can get another one on there. This one's now all grown up. Let's get this out of this working area. 
did that last Halloween, but we usually can't handle more than one session, mainly because of the screams and the headaches. <laughs> yeah. It, um, it makes it harder as well when you're streaming, as, as you know, if you're playing with a lot of other um, people, um, and if they're streaming and they've got their own chat that they're dealing with, quite often you'll be running along and they'll stop and to chat with their with their people and then all of a sudden it, it's a little bit disjointed. Um, it can get very disjointed if you're playing with lots of other streamers. Did I not solve that guy? Wobbly love. Holy moly, pineapple. who's coming in? Ned coming in with a gifted sub for septic. Holy shitballs. Pineapple. Ned, pineapple. you're a generous man. Here we go. Gifted it's sub for singing from time Ned with oh. Wobbly. Lee. This one's for you, Cliffy. Oh, Let's Lee. lick the No, we didn't. Frog. Didn't soulball him. Kill the Septic at Ned. Thanks for the gift. Make Cheers, the Ned. shit logs. I agree. Thank you, Ned. Go and put them in, in the, the wall. Let's oh, go. Let's More go. singing. Come on, Wobbly. You can do it. This poor yes, girl. Can. She's sleeping on the singing job. Singing on a Friday. Whoop, 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 whoop. No, that. Holy moly. Now, this girl here. Uh, I think she actually um, also got the melee and the health. So, what was it again? It was um, health 8140, melee 482. Let's get that on there. So health uh, eight eight one forty. Oh wobbly, fat fingers eight one forty. Oh wobbly, four eighty two on that. Rightio. So that's also one of our breeders as well. Um, that's one of our breeders. So we will be able to um, get that better statisticals into some of those when we're breeding them that's one of the things that i enjoy with arc like you've got the survival aspect of it you've also got the crafting aspect you're able to level your character you can personalize your character and you can the when you get your level you can spend it lots of different ways in personalizing your, the type of character that you want um lots of crafting there's um eating and surviving from dinos there's taming dinos there's breeding dinos like the depth of content there's base building is um pretty deep as much as art can be a pain in the ass of a game depth of content is pretty good and there's a lot of different maps to explore and play on um so pretty damn cool right let's get uh we're on the mission for making wreck saddles baby now, can I actually get that ghost skin down onto one of those others as well? I'll put it on the higher level one. Um, fiber, fiber hide and ingots, probably. Fiber hide and ingots. Chat's going off. Holy moly, crazy. Um, did that last Halloween? Many of those. Ned with the gifted Stambo at Septic. You need to try Subnautica. My first playthrough had the hairs on the back of my neck standing up constantly. So I tried it, Stambo. First big fish of meat. <laughs> Old F Ford. <laughs> what a stuff's a big no no. Uh, I am. Um, Subnautica's on my list, but because I've got so many games that are going on, um, yeah, it's a bit of a. Okay, 27 seconds here, wobbly. Let's see if we can get this one to 100% match imprinting which would be really nice and um, yeah Subnautica it's on my wish list but uh, similar to a lot of other games that I play as well now I'm working out my new schedule this uh, go hard in 2023 series that I'm doing on each of the games um, I'm gonna hopefully finish this series off and uh, oh shit uh, okay I'm gonna have to do it this way let's get you to follow uh, quickly, 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 follow distance, lowest, jump off the edge here. Hopefully not suffer fall damage. Come on, get down here, get some imprinting. No, it's trapped down here. Come on, get your imprint. There we go. Nice. 
Okay, we got to 100%. That's good. I oh, know you can come up this way. Holy moly! Wait, stop! Stop! Stop being so close! Okay. Behavior, we'll get that from lowest back out to medium. Um, we could soul ball you. Uh, we'll put you up here with the others. Actually, this was, I think, the good one as well. And we'll catch up with chat. Now, this is the uh, 204. We had a slightly higher one, didn't we? But this also got the health and the melee, which was the 8, 140, and 482. Let's change that. So the health, 8140, and melee damage at 482. Alright, so we can greet her. We'll leave you there. You're safe with all these others. Safety in numbers there. Now, but we thought we made a saddle, didn't we? You're actually one of our breeders. I'm going to put that skin on to you. That costume. So the other good thing with Ark, they do lots of um, events, Halloween events and um, Summer Bash and Winter Bash and Spring and Coloured Dinos and all this sort of thing. So they're constantly working on the game, uh, adding new dinos in with new maps and things like that. So which has really definitely been a, a key to the overall success of, um, of it. So 8140 and 482, so that's definitely what, what we've got. Right, holy moly, catch up with chat again. It's gone 